Anthony Pettis versus Rafael de Sanyos. Anthony Pettis. Anthony Pettis is a, a league above any other guy right now in the division, and I think he he could do whatever he wants. Submit him in the first round, knock him out in the first round, do some spinning kick, whatever. Doesn't matter. I think uh, he's one of the guy. He's one of the best guys in the world right now, and and he's really proven it in all of his fights. Uh, Pettis decision. Pettis. Um. I, don't, I think, you know, watching uh, DeSantis' last fight was really, really good, a real dominating, um, dominating win over um, Nate Diaz, you know, so um, that's a really tough one to call, but I think I don't, I think uh, Pettis striking again is just too, just too crisp. I'm going to go with Pettis. Uh, the way he worked out his last fight, he was a great, um, but Dos Anjos, he came out strong against Vincent Henderson, uh, but I think Anthony Pettis is a monster right now. And Pettis. Okay. And how did he do that? Don't know, because uh, Dosanos has been on the tear and he's submitting guys as well. Pettis has that crazy strike and the crazy submissions. It'd be a great fight. Okay. Um, you know, I, I, I just want to give it to Pettis um, just right off the bat, but Dosanos has been doing some really special stuff lately, and, you know, I, I hate to overlook um, look guys when they're just, just on the tear, and he has been. Um, but I really need to like see certain fights like this one. I'd like to break down his fight and, and watch some film on Dos Anjos before I could really even say yes or no. Um, but he's been on a tear. So, uh, uh, best of luck to him. I just watched, uh, Dos Anjos fight in, uh, in my hometown of, F of Phoenix and he put on a great show. Tough, tough fighter. Um, you know, Pettis is, is very comfortable in the striking department and he's been in those championship fights before. So I'm gonna have to go with Pettis.